Kadoosh. How's it everybody? Came down here today to the old stomping grounds. Episode one was actually filmed right around this corner. Wanted to try to get some uh, late afternoon fishing in. Pretty late already, so I only got maybe about an hour of fishing today. But had some time, I wanted to get a little bit of action in. Today I'm running a 3 4 ounce Castmaster, one of the gold ones. Uh, 15 pound braid, 16 pound fluorocarbon. Cast King Kodiak 2000 size at American Tackle Company custom rod. So I got a good hour or so before I gotta head out of here and get home. That's one more hour than zero hours, so stoked on that. I'm just gonna be dedicating this whole time to lure game. I don't have any kind of bait with me, nothing like that. High tide is in one hour, so I'm fishing that peak little come up, which is a uh, Usually a pretty good time to fish. Oh, already slipping. It's actually really windy today though. Not optimum in that regard. I'll probably make my way over to the beach in a bit, try that out. Make it work. Water is uh, pretty murky today. Not super bad, but definitely a little murky. So I'm gonna try here a few casts more. And then I'm gonna shoot around this point. Try over there. And then, last effort, try the beach. The whole spectrum. So I try to stay real mobile today and not just get bogged down in one spot. Oh, had a chase. Small fish, but still a fish. Alright, couple more casts out, and I'm gonna migrate. Got some guys fishing over there on the break wall. I wonder if it's going off on that side. Time to migrate. Try a zone, move on to the next. Oh, some old jagged, broken glass just cruising over here. Just waiting for some poor person to step on it and gash their foot open. The trash can literally 10 feet away. One less piece of danger on the shore. Oh, they cleaned this area out. I wonder why. It used to be totally filled with branches and leaves and stuff. I guess they're trying to make this area a little more nice. Try right over here. Would have been good to have my tubbies today, but here we go. All right, no go in this spot. Next location. Oh, I just stepped on a dozing Kiave thorn. Ugh. Well, keep your eyes peeled for those. This whole area is Kiave Central. Looks like a pretty sweet zone. Real shallow right in here though. Have to find a way to avoid those rocks. This should work. There's episode one point. Oh, we're on. Yeah. Nice hit, nice hit. Nice hit, little Papillo. Yee! <laughs> Small little Milu. Right on. Oh, <laughs> how's it? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Bye Papillo. Bye. Trapped in there. Oh, there it goes. Shoots! <laughs> Yee! No worries, I just got spooked. I was like, oh! <laughs> okay, got a little action today. All right, I'll do one or two more casts here. Switch over to the next point. Oh, am I on? Yep. 
Nope. I think my lure's just dangled up. Yeah, my lure's just dangled up. That happens. Gets caught on itself. Treble hooks will do that. All right, one more cast and we'll keep migrating. Might have taken the only little papillo out of this sector and scared him into a whole other realm. Okay, next zone, let's go. Yeah, this area is definitely being taken care of more. At least there's not a billion Calabe thorns on the trail anymore like there used to be. Still a whole bunch if you go anywhere else, but. Oh, like right there, never mind, scratch that. Speak of the devil, Calabe thorn right on the trail. Ooh. Oh, and here comes the Calvi Forest. So, spot number one is right on the other side of all these bushes. I don't feel like charging over there right now, though. I'm gonna keep going down, see what's over on the next point over. And then maybe I'll hit this spot back up on my way back, or just go shoot straight over to the beach. Yeah, plus I don't wanna dangle through all this Calvi right now. <laughs> Nice, this area looks good. Oh, heck yeah. Good choices. I'm gonna start right there, cast that direction. Out into this little channel right here. Let's go. Whoa, look at the amount of koopy pee growing on these rocks. This place is loaded, dude. So many all piled up in one spot. A bunch over there too. Must be some kind of like, either super healthy zone or like breeding time. Oh great, just got blasted by a wave. Oh no. Oh no. Tree dangling over here. Sick, let's get up there. Oh, sweet, all right. Should have checked out what's above me before I just start blasting it around. All right, one more cast. I'm gonna keep on keeping on. No signs of hits in this area. I'm gonna go one more point over, right over here. And then I'm gonna make my way back the other direction. Gotta watch out for Kiave. All right. Got a good feeling about this spot. Some reefs, some rocks right here. Some sand on the backside. A mixed plate of substrates. I haven't seen sand here in like ever. You know what? I'm just gonna charge one speed to the last point in this area before the other beach. Then I'll go back, I just gotta go fast. Actually had a chase right there at the end. Kinda looked like it might be a Roy though. It was dark. All right, two more casts here. Time to start heading back the other way. See if I got a little bit more time when I'm over there to fish that beach. Okay. I'm gonna try that bay where I hit that small papillo. Hit there a few more times. And then go all the way to that beach, try there. I did not see that person in the bushes earlier when I caught that first papillo. Scared me pretty bad. <laughs> totally biffed the fish because of it. Should have been paying more attention behind me, I guess. All right, let's try this sector out one more time. Tides come up a little bit. Pretty much covering my nice little rocks. Here we go. Bruh, I'm so salty. Ah, my line broke. At my cast master. You for real? There it goes 
ten dollars down the drain. Snapped. Na -na napped. I should have put a swivel on the Castmaster. I know that those edges are sharp, bro. What am I doing? All right, straight to the beach from here. I have one more Castmaster, a silver one. Yes, I'll try that one out. Hopefully not blast it into the other side of the universe. Sad. I gotta start checking my knots and my ties and everything more often than just blasting, 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 break off. I mean, at least it wasn't a knot that broke, but the end result is no better. All right, I'm gonna go cruise in the shade for a few minutes, reset, and fish for like 10 more minutes. Go for goat. This time I'm putting a snap so I have one more cast master, it's a silver one. We will see. Bro, why did the silver cast master come with a ring and the gold one didn't? Cast master, I want my gold one back, bro. I'm putting that on you guys. All right. We're back in action. I got like 20 more minutes of solid fishing time left, so time to start blasting. One more fish before the end of the day would be epic. So far, nothing. What I'm thinking is, since what takes the most time anyway is usually getting back to your car and leaving, what I'm gonna do is go to my truck, drive over to the brake wall over there, and then fish literally right in front of my truck so I can fish like 10 more minutes and then just jump into my truck and bail. Then I'll have done the whole spread from north of this area all the way down to the south side of this area. Cast two more times here and migrations. All right, that plan is in action. Truck's right there. And it's a short little four minute drive over to that other spot. I have a good like 10, 15 minutes of blasting it there. I'll be pushing it and it'll be time to go. You guys get any luck? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Nice. See, mix the ball, but Oh, yeah. Oh, wow, they are in right now. Huh, damn it, I'm totally not fishing the right way. <laughs> Blowing it. All right, good luck, guys. You sent some out? Uh, he just one out. Right on. Hope it gets cracked. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seeing flashes over here. There's some small papillo inside right now. Oh no, I see a fishing line in that tree right there. Ugh, dangalicious zone. Wonder if the lure's still attached to it. There's plenty of line. Nah, somebody's dunk got tragically dangled in there. Oh, I'm on. Yeah, a little papillo, I think. Oh, it oh, came off, bruh. Tiny little guy. Second little one of the day that came off. You see the bait ball right in front of me. Pretty big this year. It's going down over there too, oh. Yeah, that little tiny fish are cracking it every time it goes through that ball. I'd like to either bring one in or hook up on a big one and bring that in actually. That'd be even better. You can see the point I walked to way over there on the background. Man, I hope that's not just a shallow spot I'm bouncing it off of because every time it goes through there, it feels like it's getting a little hit or so. so I keep sending it through. Well, I can see splashes over there. That's something. A little, oh yeah. Little flashes of silver going through there. Oh, I'm being blessed with a little shade from this tree. Thank you, tree. How much line is caught in these things? This one's got choke. On. Uh, uh, on. Little tiny papillo, we're on. Oh, for real? <laughs> These must be the smallest papillo over there hitting this. I should be using a grub. I'm already too dedicated. Popped off again. I could see the pack chasing it this time. All the little baby ones. Hopefully that means the big ones are in there somewhere lurking. 
frick. Again. Oh, it's on something. What is that? A little hollow Oh my god. <laughs> I snagged a hollow <laughs> Oh, there it goes. Can't believe I just snagged one of these. Frick, should have brought my dunk. And out this little hollow loo. How's that cute guy? Yee! Oh, you guys like one more? Oh, yeah. Sure. Sure. Snagged him on the cast master. <laughs> Bro. Yeah. That's the smallest fish I've ever caught on a cast master. Back over there. Man, if I brought my dunk, that would have been sent out there. Even a big bobber actually would have been pretty good. All these little hollow are gonna go out eventually, going through the depths, and then become a, a kule. It's the big version of hollow Once they get past, what, like seven inches, I think? Maybe a little more? Kule tastes amazing. Man, I should come just hit up the hollow later on this week. Fry them up, ooh. On. Another hollow Oh my god, dude. Oh, it popped off. <laughs> this treble hook snagging hollow on accident. Looking for the things that are trying to eat the hollow I should have thought about it. It is the time to be catching them here. I don't know why I didn't bother just bringing that kind of rig instead. But ah, whatever. It was kind of a last minute fishing thing for the day. At least I'm getting a little bit of action. Beautiful Pu'ukohola sitting there in the background. I'm gonna have to jet soon. I'm only gonna get a few more casts in. It's gonna be time to go. Oh, another snag. I know there's like kudas and papillo and stuff. Gotta be trying to eat that. I saw one barracuda chasing maybe five minutes ago when I had the camera off. Small one though, it was only like eight inches. Another snag. Oh, all of them are right in front of me right now. Why does it feel so heavy? My cast master all dangled again? Oh, I got another one. <laughs> oh, the snag master. <laughs> Bruh. How's that for unproportional? Oh, it tried to hit it. This one went for it, dude. This one's bleeding. I'm gonna give it to these guys too. Come on. Soup. You got a couple nice size ones in there. Right on. Would have just released that one, but it got thrashed. At least someone can grind it. Let's check the time. Literally got five more minutes. That's ten more casts. On. Another one, dude. That one came off. This is the best I've done at Hololu fishing, and I'm not trying to catch them right now. <laughs> I just gotta do this every time, I guess. I wonder if they hit one of those tiny little cast masters, or if I'm literally just snagging them on accident every time. All right, last cast for this zone. Out there. I guess that's the last cast for the day. Not just this zone. We'll go to either the same zone or some other zone next time. Oh, on. On for the last cast. Off. It was another little hollow <laughs> 
Or is it still on? Nope, definitely not. All right, everybody. That was fun. I got a jet. I got to go to the other side where that mountain is. So, solid little drive. Huge mahalo for watching, everybody. Until the next one. Dadoosh.